Hello, welcome, I'm so happy you're here. In this video, I am going to talk about why you don't have to wait for your desire. You don't have to wait for your desire. I'm gonna talk about why that is in this video. Before I jump in, I want you to know I have three free eBooks linked in the description below. Help yourself to all three, sign up to receive all three. There is an eBook to manifest a specific person, one to manifest new love, and one to manifest money. Enjoy, they're yours for free. Okay, let's talk about this. Why do you not have to wait for your desire? Here is the deal, and I really want you to understand this. When we are manifesting, we, most of us know by this point, what we are doing is we are changing ourselves. How are we changing ourselves? Moment by moment, we are using our imagination or we are using techniques to step into the experience of already having our desire. We are, again, doing that with our imagination, with our inner world. So you can, in one moment, close your eyes and imagine that you are already in a relationship. Maybe it means imagining you have a ring on your finger. Maybe it means you imagine holding the hands with your beloved. Maybe it means you imagine being held in bed doesn't matter. For that one moment, you are imagining that you already have your desire. If you're using affirmations, it's the same thing. You are affirming that you already have your desire for that one moment. In that one moment where you truly are evoking an end experience, a living in the end experience that you have your desire, guess what happens in that moment? There is no more waiting. Why is there no more waiting? Even if the desire has not shown up in the 3D reality yet, you in that moment feel as though you have your desire. That is what living in the end is. That is what the wish fulfilled is. It is learning how to use your inner world in a way that in this moment, regardless of the 3D reality, you already feel like you have your desire. Why is this so powerful? Because this is the essence of manifesting. As you learn to feel like you already have your desire just in this one moment, but then you practice it again in another moment and again in another moment and again in another moment and you practice it using an affirmation and then you practice acting as if and then you practice an imaginal act or maybe you just stick to one technique that you love but you practice feeling like you already have your desire moment after moment after moment guess what no more waiting for your desire. Because if you feel like you have your desire, you are no longer waiting for it. And this is the trick, the catch, the secret to manifesting. What we are doing is we are using our inner worlds, our imagination to change what we think and feel moment by moment. And that is what is eventually going to change the, the 3D reality. But you have to remember the change in the 3D reality comes after you change. So you want to be looking for in your inner state, am I waiting for my desire? Am I waiting around? Am I hoping it comes? Or in this moment, can I feel like it's already here? Can I feel it is done? Can I feel it is inevitable? It's going to happen for me. This is your work as a manifester is to step into the inner experience of it's already happening. You will notice in that moment, there is no more waiting. And when there is no more waiting and you are truly embodying the inner experience of this is going to happen, it's going to happen. That's when your manifestation becomes a guarantee. It becomes a done deal. When you are able to transport yourself into the experience of not waiting for it for any more because it's already here in your imagination. That's what manifesting is. Thank you for being here with me in this video. I love being here with you. I'll see you soon. Bye.